Hello, everybody, Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Berry Hills, and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. Happy holidays to everyone. It is the last two weeks of the years. Next year, next weekend is uh, Christmas, and then we have New Year's. Girl, it's all about the holidays. Like, girl, have fun. I have like a little party in a little bit. So, like, that's why I'm an elf right now. Watch my previous uh, videos if you want to know the whole story. And I'm very excited because this is this is what I do on the holidays. I'm a sucker for the holidays. I love Christmas. I love, you know, the parties. I love the costumes. I love to just have fun and be together with family and friends and spread the joy and just be happy. You know, so I'm hoping that you are doing the same. And if you have to work these last two weeks, honestly, fuck it. Like, that's my advice. I mean, it's the last two weeks of the year. The company is not going to burn out, you know, like nothing is going to be destroyed. Just take it down a notch. Like you you deserve, like it should be illegal to have to work in these two weeks. You know what I mean? Anyways, guys, I want to welcome every single one of you. If you are new here, welcome to the Verbally Troop. I have seen a lot of new faces, so I'm very excited about that. So welcome, welcome, welcome. And you know, we're here. We keep it real. We spill the tea every single day. We talk about Bravo. We talk about pop culture. We talk about everything. So you know what to do. Subscribe, 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 and hit the notification bell. And if you're in the mood, just share the videos everywhere because that's how we're going to get more people to join our channel. Okay? Just share, share, share everywhere. All right, guys. So let's leave the Bravo verse for a second, and we're going to be talking about this pop culture street, honey. We need to go down because they are getting dirt here on this christmas guys so let's talk about kardashians for a little bit specifically miss kendall jenner because she was supposedly be dating bad bunny you know and apparently according to tmc and a bunch of other news outlets out there the couple is done so yeah i mean girl i have no idea but to me it has always been like super weird because first of all i don't know if you know this but Probably, but like Bad Bunny is literally one of the biggest artists right now in Latin America. You know, like he is like the Taylor Swift of Latin America. Like everything that he touched, it, it becomes gold, you know? So it was super weird that out of nowhere, literally out of nowhere, he was dating Kendall Jenner. You know, it was like, what? How? When? Does even this like make sense, you know? Um, there was a lot of backlash at the beginning, like a lot of backlash. People were not happy of the two of them dating because Kendall Jenner has been accused several times before this of like appropriating Mexican culture and Latino culture, you know, and she did like some commercials here and there that were like very like weird, you know, and like people were not happy. And it's like, is this like a PR stunt like you are being known for you know like doing all of these things to the Latino community and a, and a community that is not really happy with you and then out of nowhere mama Chris Jenner who literally is controlling the world right now uh goes and you know start this dating situation with the biggest Latino celebrity in the world so a lot of people were like definitely raising, you know, their eyebrows and being like, mm, is this real? You know, like, is this really happening? And then what happened next is super weird. The couple never went official, you know, like there was never like a like, you know, Instagram post and like, uh, like, this is my boo. I love him, you know, thinking about marriage, you know, together forever, like nothing. Like, they, they, they were seen on dates. There was a lot of paparazzi pictures, you know, horseback riding and, like, doing things, you know, and, like, kissing and all of that. But just pictures, but nothing official. And if there is anything that you know with the Kardashians, is that they are very public. So it's like, why are you not, like, putting anything out there? Now, of course, there is a lot of talk that we're probably going to be seeing a lot of this on the show, you know, on, on probably next season or something. But uh, I don't know. To me, it, it is it is a little bit weird. The whole thing, it's a little bit weird. It's a little bit, like, sketchy that 
you know, she was doing that. But the fact is that for a very long time, I think since, let me just check this. I think since September, if I'm right, um, the last time that we saw Kendall and Bad Bunny together was in the back, way back in late October, I'm sorry, when they hit up a breakfast place in Beverly Hills after a big Halloween bash the night prior, you know. Um, that was the last time that they were sung together. And then done so. So I don't know. I think they were like PR dating, you know. I mean, I'm, I'm thinking things happen, you know. It's not like, I mean, everyone literally wants bad money, you know. But I don't think it was never a serious thing. You know, I don't think Con Kendall ever ever thought that, you know, this was going to be the father of her kids or, you know, her future husband. Um, I think it was very much a move by Mama Chris, which I respect, to be honest, because, look, we all know the same by now. Like, the, the devil works hard, but Chris Jenner works even harder. So, do you. I am not mad about the whole situation, you know. But yeah, apparently they are now officially over. You know, there are so, not even said by them, but the, the same sources, you know, are saying that they are done. But it's not like a, a bad breakup. It's not like there is animosity or anything. They were just like, hey, girl, I haven't seen you in like two months. Are we still dating? And he was like, who is this? And he's like, Bad Bunny. And he's like, oh, bye. You know, done. So they're like not mad at each other. There was no cheating. There was no nothing, you know, and it was pretty much it. Let's wait and see, you know? Let's wait and see because I, you know, a lot of people were begging Bad Bunny to finish that relationship because you know the course of the Kardashians when it comes to their men. But uh, yeah, let's wait and see. I mean, look, I never pictured them together, okay? Kendall, she's going to end up with like, I don't know, some random white guy. That's what I see her kind of, even if she, I actually she gave me kind of like, asexual vibes to be honest with you let's wait and see so anyways let me know what you guys think on the comments below okay and uh before i leave guys remember that my giveaway end up in two days with rose forever so don't forget to go to my instagram go to the official post follow the rules it's super easy and you might win okay december 20th we are picking the winner get into it and if you still want to get your flowers, my discount code is still working. The description for everything is and the, the I'm sorry, no, the links for everything are in the description below. Okay. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. And don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.